Hey guys, welcome to our channel Chill on You 2. Forget robots that look like humans. The next generation of robots will be based on animals, from snakes to locusts and even robotic octopus that can study the ocean floor. When it comes to robots, science fiction has conditioned us to think of androids, bipedal machines approximating the human form. But the next generation of robots may be based on very different types of animals, snakes, flies, locusts, and even the multi-tentacled octopus. Scientists are hard at work on such contraptions. Here's a look at seven of the most fascinating designs that can help with everything from exploring our insides to cleaning up the mess we make on the planet. So without further ado, let's check these robots out. You guys will be shocked to see the second robot on this list. Number seven, Smart Bird. For the Smart Bird, Festo was inspired by the Herring Gull. The ultralight flying model impresses with its outstanding aerodynamics and maximum agility and can take off, fly, and land without an additional drive. In doing so, its wings not only beat up and down but twist in specific manner. This is done using an active articulated torsion drive, which provides both lift and propulsion. With this functional integration, Festo has technically deciphered bird flight. In combination with complex regulation systems, flight efficiency of a degree previously thought of as unattainable has been realized and ensured through ongoing diagnosis. Through the flight, data such as wing position and battery charge status are continuously recorded and monitored in real time. While its uses aren't as utilitarian, at least it won't poop on you. Number 6. The MIT Mini Cheetah MIT's new Mini Cheetah robot is springy and light on its feet, with a range of motion that rivals a champion gymnast. The four-legged power pack can bend and swing its legs wide, enabling it to walk either right side up or upside down. The robot can also tour over even terrain about twice as fast as an average person's walking speed. Weighing in at just 20 pounds, lighter than some Thanksgiving turkeys, the limber quadruped is no pushover. When kicked to the ground, the robot can quickly right itself with a swift, kung fu-like swing of its elbows. Perhaps most impressive is its ability to perform a 360-degree backflip from a standing position. Researchers claim the Mini Cheetah is designed to be virtually indestructible, recovering with little damage even if a backflip ends in a spill. In the event that a limb or motor does break, the Mini Cheetah is designed with modularity in mind. Each of the robot's legs is powered by three identical low-cost electric motors that the researchers engineered using off-the-shelf parts. Each motor can easily be swapped out for a new one. Number 5. Spider Robot T8 Legged robot kits aren't anything new, but unlike its competition, the T8 Octopod comes with a disturbingly realistic 3D printed exoskeleton that is sure to make an unforgettable first impression. Robotics, a robotics company based in Hong Kong, is living up to its name with this lifelike robot tarantula. The T8 is powered by 26 high-tech H5 35HD servo motors, 3-inch leg, and additional servers to wiggle its abdomen. This is a fairly small servo type with low torque, so its performance is somewhat limited, but it keeps the costs down. The company is also offering a hexapod robot called the Itzy, but that one is smaller and doesn't have a realistic shell. It's made out of PCB and comes with 20 servos, which are even smaller and cheaper than those in the T8. Number 4. Robotic Snake Medrobotic's signature product, the Flex Robotic System, allows physicians to reach deep into the body with minimal risk. The Flex System is based on a snake with multiple mechanical links. The snake robot's eyes see in 3D to help the surgeon navigate. The physician controls the snake's movement via a video game-like joystick. Once in place, the Flex can become rigid, allowing a surgeon to pass through its instruments, which can cut or sutter. The instruments are also controlled robotically by the joystick. Flex is ideal for exploring nonlinear or certicus parts, like you guessed it, the colon, a tricky and sometimes dangerous task using a traditional straight endoscope. Flex can enter through the mouth as well, allowing physicians to reach tough access areas of the body such as the larynx and vocal cords. Number 3. Rooster Robot Roosters are best known for waking people up at dawn as they announce the start of a new day. 
But when the rooster is a robot, it can also save people's lives. The rooster is a new robot from Israeli startup Robotican that can help reach injured victims of natural disasters where it's not safe to send a human rescue worker. Rooster got its name from the fowl's preference for walking but being able to fly when necessary. Most of the time it walks, but when it runs into an obstacle, it can hover and fly. That makes Rooster different from most other search and rescue robots, which can either walk or fly, but not both, meaning they can get stuck or are too high above the ground to search effectively for survivors. cock a doodle doo Number 2. Locust Robots Inspired by the common locust, a tiny high-jumping robot developed in Israel could be used for sending life-saving reconnaissance data to human rescue teams in disaster situations, or for cleaning up oil spills, or for gathering intelligence and many other difficult missions unsuited for large robots and humans. The researchers believe the robot will perform well in search and rescue missions in rough terrain. Why a locust? Apparently, this insect is very efficient when it comes to movement. Locusts store mechanical energy to enhance the action of their leg muscles. A scientist replicated this in the robot, which stores energy in the spring. Thanks to this design, the tiny robot can jump 11 feet high more than twice the height of similar sized robots, according to the researchers, and cover a horizontal distance of more than four feet in one leap. Number one, emotion butterflies. Flying is a recurring theme in the Bionic Learning Network. The developers channel their knowledge gained from the projects on the bionic opter and the emotion spheres into one bionic butterfly. They combine the ultralight construction of artificial insects with coordinated flying behavior in a collective. Ten cameras installed in one room record the butterflies using their infrared markers. The cameras transmit the position data to a central master computer, which coordinates the butterflies from the outside. The intelligent networking system creates a guidance of monitoring system which could be used in the networked factory of the future. In order to replicate their natural role model as closely as possible, the artificial butterflies feature highly integrated onboard electronics. They're able to activate the wings individually with precision and thereby implement the fast movements. As the wings slightly overlap, an air gap is created between them when they beat, which gives the butterflies their special aerodynamics. With the butterflies, Festo is taking another step into the areas of miniaturization, lightweight construction, and functional integration. The emotion butterflies, impressed with an intelligently employed mechanical system and the smallest possible power units in the tightest spaces. The reduced use of materials enables true to nature flying behavior. Say it with me. Wow. All right, guys, that's the end of this video. Seven craziest robot animals you never knew existed. We hope you really enjoyed it. Thanks for tuning in. But before you go, subscribe, like, and share this video. But don't forget, hit that bell icon to check out more interesting videos made just for you.